Hey guys, this is uh, Psychic Tracy Brown coming to you today. And um, today is the 8th, and yesterday was 7 7. And I forgot to mention that because I have this thing with numbers. So I didn't mention that yesterday was 7 7 8. 5 6 7 8. And today is 7 8 8. Hi guys. Thank you for the heart. Hi, Desi. Thank you for the heart. Oh, you know what I just realized? I think every day that you join, your color changes. Because, Desi, you are aqua yesterday. And today, you're this slate gray. You're exactly the same color as I have on today. Like a slate gray. Hi, guys. So. <laughs> oh, my God. Hi, honey. I don't have my glasses on. I should wear my glasses so I could read what you guys are saying. Hi, how are you? Um, tomorrow, guys, um, we're going to have uh, questions on Periscope on the Bill Cosby debacle. It's just, oh wait, I wonder if I should say that for Sean. I should say that for the after show with Sean. The Bill Cosby debacle. But you know what? I gotta tell you, Sean is worse than me. He knows nothing about pop culture. At least I have people that keep me informed. Even though I call myself the pop culture psychic. Um, I know nothing about... <laughs> okay, I'll make it to third. <laughs> Fine. Because you know Sean. If you guys don't know Sean, get to know Sean. He has a mouth on him. Oh my God. Like, literally, sometimes, like, before every show, like, sometimes I have to yell at him. And I have to give him a list of things that he can and cannot talk about. <sighs> okay. All right, guys. Come on. Tigger. Tigger and the Kardashians and Mama Ja Chris and... Those those girls, the K's, I like to call them the K's. Hi, honey. Hi, Purple Heart. Thank you. Uh, Tigger. Tigger. Okay, now, if you guys don't remember, I did a, a video on whether Tigger and Kylie Jenner were dating. Because he had denied it. Remember, she went off to France to have sex with him. Because it would be illegal here. But over there... You know, they can freely romp and no Tigger couldn't get arrested, right? Okay, so, and I got that right because ultimately, I think she's still 17, by the way, but ultimately, they're dating, all right? No big deal, right? But then, I stated in that video that he is using you, Kylie. He's using you. Oh. And this kind of proves it because if he's sending um, his nakedness to Mia, the transgender, what, what, is, what is going on, Tigger? Like, what is going on? And psychic minds need to know. And you guys realize I just have fun with this. I'm accurate, but it's really just a lot of fun. So let's have fun. Let's be accurate and let's be fun. Call me for your own personal reading. Hey, thank you for joining, Tom Tom, V Tom Tom. Thank you for joining and call me for your own personal readings at 818-985-2010, 818-985-2010. Skype me and you can Skype me. I'm changing my name, by the way, on my Skype. It's going to be Pop Culture Psychic. And you can, we can FaceTime. We could, uh... It's Tigger Gay. I'm looking at that. We could, uh, uh, you can call in, regular phone, 818-985-2010. Darn it, I forgot to tape. You know, I thought I had all the time in the world because I wasn't taping it. I always forget to tape. I always forget to do my job. Hold on. Let me just do it at 10 minutes, just in case. Because then I have to cut it up and, I, you know, I have to cut up, like, important parts of the video. It's Tigger, it's Tigger Gay. You know, one, two, three, four, five. You know, I'm really being facetious. I'm not asking if, if Tigger is gay because I think gay is a state of mind, right? 
What I'm asking is, does Tigger go both ways? I had a reading with you last month. It was great. Ah! Yeah! <laughs> oh, toot, 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 toot. <laughs> she said she had a reading with me last month, and it was great. Thank you. Oh, my God. Thank you so much. That just makes me so happy. Okay, hold on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It's Ticket Gate. Okay, let's take a look. It's t oh dear. Oh dear. Um. Oh dear. <laughs> Oh dear, oh dear, ah, uh, oh dear. Uh, okay, I gotta share this with you guys, right? Because it's a secret inside my head. There's some unconscious coupling that's going on with Tigger. Unconscious coupling, <laughs> Un right? Unconscious coupling, that's not um, Gwyneth Paltrow. Unconscious coupling, is that Gwyneth Paltrow? Oh, well, I stole it. There's some unconscious coupling with Tigger and Mia. Yes. There's some unconscious coupling with Tigger and Mia. So I'm not going to ask if he's gay. I'm going to say, did he sleep with Mia? Yeah, he did. He did. And now it's kind of exposed. It really is. And now he has to find a way to like act like, you know, it's, it's, it's not what it is. It, it is. So. There is a potential for him to get closer to Kylie. Oh, Kylie. He's going to try and get closer to you. The horn is blown, and he knows that he's gay. He is. Um, but I got to tell you, he does not want to lose Kylie. He just doesn't. I don't know if he doesn't want to lose Kylie's money. Thank you for the hearts. I don't know if he doesn't want to lose Kylie's money or if he doesn't want to lose Kylie herself. My last card is a surprising card. It's a star card. And if I take it literally, particularly by the way the oracles are reading it, is um, that he doesn't want to lose the stardom <laughs> that's around. He doesn't want to lose the benefits that's around being with Kylie. There's a lot of benefits being with her. All right? Um, oh, yes. This card is a, like, it's like sneaky. It's like, I'm going to take my stuff and I'm going to go over here for a minute. I mean, it has other things, other meanings, but we're talking about kind of like cheating, but not really cheating because he walked into this relationship with Kylie being this person. He sleeps with Mia, the transgender. He just does. Own it, Tigger. Own it. You know what, Tigger? I got to tell you. The black community kind of needs you to own it. You know? Because uh, uh, there's people on the down low. And, um, you know, the down low is not good. Because just stop the down low. And, Tigger, you could be like um, Caitlin. And you could be on the forefront of um, something amazing. So you could stop being on the down low and you can come out and you could say, I sleep with men, I sleep with women. Which is why he chose the transgender. Because the transgender still has her parts. She did not get rid of her parts. She still has her male organs. And so he likes Mia because Mia feels like a woman. She looks like a woman, but she got the male junk. I'm just reporting what the cards say, people. I'm not trying to um, out him. <laughs> he outed himself. Um, th this card, you know, I had a conversation with someone about this card yesterday, the, the King of Wands. Could mean a person or it could mean a description. And in my deck, if you look at my deck, it looks like a very sleazy man with his legs open. And God knows what he does with those things, right? In between his legs, right? That's my deck. It, sometimes it's a description, and sometimes it's a man. But for most part, for the most part, in my deck, it's like a very disgusting, sneaky man. Oh. And Tigger is all about the money. Tigger is with Kylie because of the money, and I had stated that before. 
Um, he has to find a way to juggle this mess that he's in. And he's going to have to break up with Mia. He's going to have to. And he's going to miss her. This card means, you know, I'm all man. I'm an emperor. I'm all man. But I'm going to miss Mia. <laughs> so in his head, he's going to miss her a lot. Because he won't be able to text her anymore. He won't be able to see her because too many people are watching. And he needs that. Like that for him, he needs Mia. Kylie may not be enough for what he's looking for. Kylie, you're just 17. You know, you're just 17. There's Kylie, you're just 17. He needs more. Um, he's going to act out. He's going to act out in public in a minute. Um, and then he's going to find a way to rise above it and move above it. Um... He's gonna, he's not gonna leave the Kardashians and they're not gonna get rid of him because you know the case, you know, they will keep their men around until they are no longer any use to them. They're like black widows, you know, when they're done, they'll just eat them and toss them out. Oh, but Tigger, you screwed up. You really did. In a weird kind of way, everyone, I really think he l likes Kylie. I really do. You know, I you know, I get the ultimate is I really, really am into her. And I want to say love. It kind of scares me to say it that way. But he has self-sabotaging antics. And he needs to sit down and sit his little junk down, you know, and close them legs to transgenders. Close those legs to transgenders, Tigger. Close those legs to transgenders. You're in a relationship. Jesus Christ. Oh, dear. Yeah. Ugh. Ew, there could be like a pre-engagement or something coming out. Ugh. Oh, Kylie. Kylie, you could do better than this. Ugh. Oh, Mama Jer, please don't let this little girl get engaged. Please don't let her get married. Please, I'm begging you. Somebody put the brakes on. And if something goes so far awry with Tigger and Kylie and they pretend to have a pre-engagement or an engagement, I got to tell you, I really think Caitlyn's going to step up and Caitlyn's, Caitlyn's going to say, Oh, hell no. No. Not my daughter. But then if Caitlyn steps up, doesn't it interfere with the whole transgender thing then? Or maybe Caitlyn will step up because Caitlyn likes this kind of drama. <laughs> Caitlyn is a K. Part of the K's is a K with a C, but a K likes the drama. Oh, this is so much fun. This is so much fun. You know what? I got to tell you, although you're going to act like you're moved on, Tigger... This is going to stress you out for the next nine months because they are going to watch your every move. And Tigger, you're going to slip up. You are going to slip up. You, you need Mia or you need to have that male experience. And so although I see you going the, the straight and narrow route and I see the potential of even getting closer because I really think you like Kylie, I think ultimately that tickle, you, you get that tickle <laughs> and you need that male junk. And you're going to slip up. I promise you. You're going to slip up. You're going to slip up. You're going to slip up. There's, that's what these, these are horrible cards. Just horrible. <laughs> oh, Tigger. Where's your mommy, Tigger? Where's your mommy? Stop this. And, and it's not like don't sleep with men. It's kind of like this is just destructive public behavior. Stop it. Oh, okay. I got to go. <laughs> This is actually a lot of fun to do, but tickets are a hot mess, and so are the case. All right, there's more vids coming, so just stay right there, you know. Unless I get a reading, I'm gonna, I've got three vids to do. And the, the K, oh, Jared. Jared, the subway guy. Oh, what in the world did he get himself into? Call me for your own personal reading 818 985 2010. 818 985 2010. Thanks, guys. Thanks for holding on. Thanks for retaining. <laughs> Stay close by. Jared's up next.